For a long time I kept asking myself, why is it that in Jude 1 9, the Bible says the, the, the body of Moses was contended with between God and Satan, the angel, the angelics and Satan. For the Bible says, Yet Michael the archangel, when contend with the devil, he disputed about the body of Moses, does not bring against him a railing accusation, but said, The Lord rebuke thee. So ask God, why is it that they they why would they fight for the man's body? And this is what the Lord told me. He said, because Moses dwelt in my presence until he got to a place where he carried the body and when Satan looked at it, he knew that this body could not die. This body had carried a certain form and Satan knew that if he can carry this body, put in another form of spirit, he can change the trajectory of human history. How could they fight for a body that could rot? It means the body of Moses could not rot. He, he, oh, he dwelt in an anointing for so long that not only was the countenance changing the skin of his face, he got to a place and a level in the spirit where his body could not rot. Otherwise, the Bible is clear. Moses was not embalmed. So if he was not embalmed, why is Satan fighting for something that can rot? Except he knew that the presence and anointing in this body can not rot. Who has understood what I just said? And it's not the first time we see an anointing dwell in bodies like that. Remember the bones of Elisha. The Bible says that the skin left the man's bones. But when those bones were thrown on a dead body, boom! The Bible says that a man came back living. Why? Because this man carried an anointing that went through the structure, their sinews, their muscles, their ligaments, their, their tendons and biceps, their triceps, and went into their bones and the ligament to the inner part of everything that touches them. It was anointed because they had a certain presence on their life. Tell your neighbor, God can anoint you deeply. And, 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 and he's at 120. And because I used to ask, why is it that people are dying early? It is because there's a certain anointing that we have not tested. Are you hearing me? There's a certain anointing. When you test it, we shall not swallow, we shall not die at 60, we shall not die at 40. Why? Because God proved through mortal men which were under a lesser covenant that he can preserve a body enough for the devil to admire it. Sharakatarapa. That is why I believe we're entering days where men are going to live for 150 years, 140 years, and it shall be said of them that their eyes are not dim, neither their natural faces are bated. If you believe that, shout, Amen. Believe God to keep you. <laughs> 